Hello everyone, Jester Tester is back. This time, we are taking a look at the OutRun cabinet and one of those annoying problems that come along with it, that loud buzzing PCB fan. And here it is guys, all right, so this problem has cropped up on many people, it even has affected mine. And one of the issues with it is, now that loud buzzing could be coming from a bad PCB fan. The bearings in the fan itself could have gone bad. If that's the case, then you're gonna have to get yourself a brand new fan. And um, we'll discuss how you can go about isolating that trouble and seeing if it is the fan itself, or if it's coming from 90% of the other problem that causes it is a bent wire that's in front of the fan. Um, hitting the fan as it rotates. Now that's important that if you hear that noise, guys, you gotta fix this problem because if it is the wire that's bent in front of the fan, it's gonna cause your fan to slow down and that limits your cooling and it could actually uh, stop the cooling from your cabinet, which in the end could uh, corrupt your PCB card. So this is very important, all right, guys? All right, um, before we get into it, if you get anything out of these videos, guys, I would appreciate it if you subscribe to the channel and give me a thumbs up on the video. All right, all right, so let's get into it. Now, a lot of people have contacted me regarding this problem and asked me if I could do a video on it, so that's what I'm gonna do. All right, so why don't we go and first we'll take a, a listen to what the, what the PCB sounds like when you have that buzzing sound, and then we'll open up the cabinet and we'll go from there. Hang in there with us, guys. All right, guys, so you heard that. You can hear that buzzing really loud. All right, so what I did was I unplugged the cabinet. I just unplugged it right here from the, from the, the uh, cabinet right there. And we're just going to take the back off to access the PCB, okay? Okay, so now we have to get inside the PCB. I'm gonna to have to uh, readjust the camera here uh, so we can get a better look up inside there. So, all right guys, so there's the main PCB housing right here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna remove the rest of these wires off of here just to get them out of our way if we can. All right, and this is your power. So we'll just take that one out for now. See if I can get this up here, get it out of our way. Now we have six screws, two, four, five, six on each side. So we just wanna remove all of those and get this housing off. Sorry about the camera guys, I'm in a tight spot here. Okay guys, so when you take this off, what you wanna do is, the best way to find out if the wire was interfering with the fan. See what happens is when, you, when this goes up, this wire here goes down and brushes into the fan. That's what's creating that buzzing, okay? So if you wanna double check and make sure if that was the case, all you now have to do is leave that hang like that, plug your power cord back in, don't touch this, just leave that hang. Turn your power back on. If now it runs quiet, you know for sure that the wires bent down into the fan. So now all you wanna do when you put this back, you could, on the holes here, the air holes, you could tie wrap this wire to the side so it doesn't move back in front of the fan because you can see where this bend is. When you turn this around, if you can see, let see if I'll move the camera closer. You can see how that bends. As I'm turning this, you'll see the, the wire starting to bend in front of the fan there. So that's what brushes the fan. Now, if you don't have this problem at the beginning, it doesn't matter because eventually gravity will allow this wire to pull out from the back of the monitor 
and it bends and it goes in front of the fan. So even people who haven't had this problem at the beginning will have this problem with the outrun cabinet eventually. They may, if that wire does creep out from behind that monitor up in there and give it enough slack to bend in front of that fan. All right, so that's all you have to do. Like I said, leave it hang, turn it back on. Don't touch anything in here. Um, turn it on and let your fan run and see if it runs quiet. If it runs quiet after you've taken this off, you know for sure it is the wires. So now all you have to do when you put it back, like I said, you could tie wrap it to the side or you can make sure that the wire bends to the side over the top. You make sure that the wire here bends over to the top away from the fan, okay, instead of bending down in front of the fan. So that's the way you fix that buzzing noise, guys, all right? It's a simple fix and it's easy to check to see if that is your trouble. Now, if you still, if you have it hanging from that and you turn it on, you still hear a loud buzzing, then it's definitely in the bearings of the fan and you'll have to just get a new fan and you just plug that right into the, you can see where the plant, the fan plugs right in here. And you just replace, you just take the four screws out, you put in the new fan and you plug it in. All right, guys, real quick, I wanted to show you what I did here. You see, I put a tie wrap here right through the side there, okay? and I tie wrapped it off to the side. That's probably your best solution uh, to keep those wires because even if you tuck them in over the top, more than likely after a while, after gravity and you're shaking the cabinet, it will fall back down. But if you just tie wrap it um, loosely, don't, don't crank down on it because you don't want to really pull on the wires and the connection here, but loosely just attach it to the side there. So this way, when you put this back, you know that the wires are going to stay sideways above the fan there and you will never have that problem again. All right, guys? So that's the best solution for that, okay? All right, so that's it, guys. That's the video. Just a tester saying be well. Happy gaming as always, guys. And until the next review, we will see you.